Talking about China, it's, it's hard to say. Uh, you know, there are multiple reasons for China, our Chinese market being weak. Uh, number one is the um, private consumption is not picking up after Corona. Another one is a weak global economy. This, of course, has an impact on an export country like China, which has a knock-on effect on Germany, too, because we are exporting to China. So it's hard to say. We hope that in the second half of the year um, there will be some, uh, some stimulus and some life. It also depends on the government if they come up with any kind of stimulus for stimulating in particular the private consumption. Hard to say. Um, on Saturday there's Chinese New Year. Maybe after that we know a little bit more. How much of a burden is the Chinese real estate crisis uh, for your business as well? Because it kind of triggers down the whole food chain, I assume. We know that in the last years, many years, Chinese economy depends to almost 30% on real estate. And uh, this is just too much. It goes down. Um, it's a controlled uh, reduction, but yet it has an impact also on the private consumption at the same time. So. Regarding our business, um, we are not so much in that area. We are more in the manufacturing space, large companies, small and medium companies, but also electrification. Electrification is still doing well. Uh, also, China is going for renewables and they are electrifying. So this is a business which runs quite well. It really goes back to manufacturing, food and beverage, chemical, automotive machine builders. And this is where we hope for a pickup then in the second half of the year.